Hi, British Vogue, this is Barbie Ferreira, and we're gonna see what's in my bag. My bags are usually very small and stuffed, so this is very characteristic of me. Almost all my bags are not very practical and are entirely just for the look. Okay, let's open it up. Of course, we have a mask. I always keep an extra mask because I sweat, so then if it gets wet or like I accidentally drop it on the floor, you know, like I don't want that on my face because I'm very allergic to everything. Um, sunglasses of my choice that day. Um, these are the ones I'm wearing this week. Usually it's not in this either. It's just like thrown in the bag, but I try to be fancy for you guys. Uh, <laughs> I like a lot of random little things, whether it be um, little stuffed animals that you can hang somewhere or like little tiny like toys and like angels and stuff. So I usually have something like that in my bag, which is very embarrassing, but yes. I have a fan. Ooh. Um, a fan is very important to me. It is what I need for work because I get really hot. Um, I like the drama of it. Um, a comb because I have a cowlick and I have bangs. Two things that do not go together whatsoever, but we make it work. I have my keys, which is a lot of things. My partner got this from a Instagram ad. This is like for like, you know, if you want to put your, your code in for a debit card or something, you can just, you don't have to touch it. A tile, so I don't lose my keys. This thing that I got from a, a French hotel, and I thought that would make me fancy if I had it on my keys, which it does. Use your imagination for what this might be for, but it opens and it's smell proof, which is great. <laughs> um, and what else? Some keys, you know, just your run of the mill keys. What else? You know, a little spritz here and there. I have a jewel charger, which I do not condone, but is absolutely always in my bag. And I would be lying if I told you it wasn't always in my bag. So I have to get that in there. My wallet. It's like an old Dolce & Gabbana wallet. I think it's like d &G. It's just like, I love these colors, like a turquoise, um, like, like jewel tones. Like those are my, those are my colors. Like that's what I like to use and wear. And it's big. It's like, a, I think it's a, like a, a men's wallet, which you know, of course, wallets do not need to be gendered, but they tend to have more room for things, such as like my old Metro cards that I keep here. You know, just like little memories and whatnot. So I keep a lot of things in here, which I think is really fun because I like to hoard a scrunchie. A hand sanitizer, which of course, very useful right now. This one is sweet orange. And then I have a little powder, a little Becca powder. It's very cooling. Sometimes if, if my bag allows, I will keep a brush in it. Sometimes I have a bag that's like this big, so it's only my card, you know, things like that. A lighter, never know when you need one. A lipstick, never know when you need that. Something that just make me cute throughout the day, why not? Oh, I have a lip gloss slash highlighter, which is the Becca Zero, so I could do that on my lips, on my high, like on my little cheekbones, you know, something to keep me going throughout the day, why not? And last but not least, a lip balm. It's a sleep mask, but it's for all day, in my opinion. And yeah, this is in my bag. I think no one's really surprised about what's in my bag, but I think, <laughs> I think because I'm not a person who ever finds things or like I kind of like lose things and I'm like, whatever. The fact that I have a tile on my keys might be a little surprising because I'm, you know, proactively combating the fact that I lose everything. You know, character growth, growing. <laughs>